Hey, what's up, everybody? Pixelated Continuum here. Back with more Everspace 2. So, as you may notice, we are not where we left off. That is because I tried to do a recording and realized I did not move my recording window. So, I, I have a where the software records a certain window that I select and I uh, did not select the window. So the recording was just a bunch of black screen, sound effects, and me talking. So all you missed was right where we left off in the last video. Flew over here to this ancient ruin, and then we found a cavern. We're trying to open up the container here. The, yeah, the container to get the thing we need. The uh, encryptor, encryptor, material encryptor, something like that. I forget what it's called now. But to hide our stuff, pretty much. So that's what we're doing. We're in the room and we're trying to open up whatever we need to in order to get this. Yeah, hopefully it works out well. Turns out good. And let's get it going. I do apologize for the gap, but these things happen. Get it going. I've already put in place a couple of runes. These runes, as you'll see here, let's see clear this, are uh, what we need to open whatever we're trying to open. These ancient rooms. Get that up. Almost like a machine, but a rock at the same time. Kinda reminds me of that thing from Transformers. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? So those two right there are ones that I've already done. One of them I came pre put in. So I haven't touched that one. Stick this one in. Hopefully we can think of what it is we need to open up. Just out of there. Got a little symbol on it. I think this is what we're trying to open here. Ancient. Sealed ancient structure. I think that's what we're trying to get into. Nothing can happen. Oh, so I can rotate these? Only have different symbols on that correspond with these? I mean, that would make sense, right? right. This one is a Z looking thing. There it is. Looking thing. Yeah. Okay. What's Thing, right? Oh. Let's go to the next one. That's alright, so that perch looking butter in looking thing. There it's it. Alright. I guess we just keep doing this until we get the ones we need. That should be it. Oh, for 
this game. Which is the worst. Like the main. Rough. For one, it, it like did not really posthumously complex, turn so. into a black hole. Yeah, I remember. They wrap things up around here before it remembers too. Ten to one that this is what the hacker's looking for. Time to get out before another warden shows up. Back to the hacker and never come back here. I agree. Well, that was fun. Let's head back to Fallon Pango. I hope you guys are doing well, and uh, I hope you're enjoying the new year. This video will be coming out soon after New Year's. I think this one will be scheduled for the fourth. Hope you guys are having a good New Year so far. Uh, do like and subscribe on the video. Channel, if you like it, there are it's a title that this video will suggest. There are many uh, Everspace videos if that's what you want to do. I have a couple other space related videos RDS, Jupiter's, Play Everything. If you like it, if you like the video, comment down below with any suggestions you might have. I'm still pretty new to this, and it's probably been like I started to be, I've just been blasting out videos as fast as possible in the early days to fill up the channel. Now that I have a good amount of content up, I will be just uh, scheduling videos to upload every day. Is this what you wanted? You found it. Care to swap this for a material encryptor? Certainly, but please be careful with it. It took me a long time to perfect it. Say, with all this information you're hoarding, what can you tell me about a man called Maddox? 
I assume you're referring to Henley Maddox, the comrade of Dexter Bashar, whose signature was broadcast alongside yours when you were held by Bloodstar. That's the guy. I don't know much. He's a very private person, and always avoided doing business with me. I understand he killed his superior during the recent war, and is now searching for something very valuable. But the only objects of real value are ancient things, like the one you just brought to me. Ancient and dangerous. The Okar guarding these artifacts closely. By the way, you may care to know that they are already on the move. Who? The Okar? Yes, a raid on Avonrest. It's been on the wavelengths for some time now. Since that's where you flew in from when coming here, I assume that is where your friend is hiding. Oh, scrap, gotta go. Don't be a stranger, Adam. <laughs> oh, scrap. That always makes me laugh when they say that. So, got some perks to do here. Dark map. One. I mean, if there's other ways to find that, there has to be, right? We can't just be battling out with these things. Yeah, I'm gonna keep these. Alright, sell those. Sell these. I'm gonna keep all these, though. It's like, maybe not these. But these two that I got from killing the warden, I'm gonna assume that you need those for something. They gotta be extremely rare. Been playing this game for a lot of hours, have only just encountered the warden. Here we stock. Oh. I have to get protect our base. Our warden. Not sure what exactly will happen here, but at least we'll find out. It's a cool screenshot. <laughs> Let's get a move. Just kind of instinct. Slap that. Maddox, come in, Maddox. The Ogar are on their way. Steam he is not responding. <laughs> Let's just hope he's ignoring me. The Ogar haven't gotten to him yet. So feel free to suggest any games, DLCs, any suggestions for the channel, design-wise, voice, gameplay-wise, anything like that. I'm definitely open to any and all suggestions. Just uh, make it constructive criticism, you know. Don't just be like, I hate you for no reason. Give me a reason why so I can change things. Be greatly appreciated. ship I got here, I'm toast. Did you get the encryptor? Yeah, transferring it as we speak. Great. Now the Okar will probably register a change to the roster once I upload this to my systems. Try to keep them off my back long enough so I can get the whole shebang running. I'm not so sure about taking on the Okar. They'll be here any minute. Come on, kid. We're in this together now. Once I'm out, I'll meet you back at Rodia Station as soon as I can make it. Well, all right. Let's do this thing. And this guy's like, get me in all kinds of stuff right now. That's messed up. <laughs> Man. Alright, let's do this thing. We have detected a register change in one of your vessels. Engage units for intercept. Check again. 
None of my people would. Oh, scrap Maddox, you idiot! We should have never taken you in. Okay, Adam. The encryptor just started overriding my systems. Shouldn't be long before I can launch. Here comes the lizard parade. <laughs> back for me? I don't. <laughs> I do not think he's coming back at all. Hey! What the? Ah, you are awake. We meet again, Mr. Roslin. Um... Oh, what? We haven't? I can never tell anymore. So many crossed paths. Anyway, I am well acquainted with you in the Roslin line. My ship... Is in the docking bay, returned by the Okar authorities who handed it over to me along with your good self. It was you who raided the Bloodstar base. Yes, looking for you. I've had quite a difficult time finding you. You need me for something, or I'd be dead already. Acutely observed, Mr. Roslin. After all, you shouldn't exist. Part of my remit was to erase every trace of the Roslin cloning facilities in the DMZ. Hundreds of loose cannons like you roaming the region and causing problems. Something had to be done about it. I can't help what I am. Don't expect pity from me. It's lucky for you that more serious matters are afoot. Pull up case file G72-844. Do you know who this is? Uh, yeah, Oscar Blakemore. He's the GMB director for all the DMZ operations. Good. And this? I only heard about it, haven't been there. Vesna mining colony in the Zarkov system. GMB regional headquarters. Good. So you seem to have some idea of the astropolitical situation in the DMZ. Look, what's this about? This is about you, Mr. Roslin. That isn't me. No, but that is Adam Roslin, Blakemore's right hand. You want me to be him. Exactly. 
I need you to infiltrate the mining colony as the other Adam Roslin and gather some information for me. And in return? I let your base stand. I let you live. I oh. guess that's good enough incentive. Not really a choice then, huh? I think I might have encountered him. When? Not long ago. The jump gate at Union Bridge. Well, it must have been him, since you are the only two Roslin clones remaining. Only two? That's right. The cloning stations have been offline for some time now, and many clones were identified and intercepted attempting to reach the homeworlds. We couldn't have that, could we? And now there is just the other Adam Roslin, who is an agent for GNB, and you, who I can't really figure out yet. You are already in a difficult position. It is time to be clear about your allegiances. You can rehabilitate yourself with the fleet and we can leave you in peace. Or, I can put you and your companions on a high priority eliminate list. Which will it be? I would take the common sense approach. Good. I have someone on the inside at the mining colony. She'll walk you through. So, we have an understanding. Yeah. Yeah. Not very hard understanding. Do what you say, I am be pleased killed. that our little discussion has proven to be a constructive one. Using the main jump gate to the Zarkov system where Vesta Mining Colony is located will not be an option, as you will be immediately registered. There's a smuggler's route I've heard of. I know someone who can get me through. Of course you do. Our agent will send you instructions once you are through to the system. My technicians have uploaded further instructions to your hive unit. You will require some extra coaching in order to convincingly portray the other Roslin. In the meantime, you and I will need to maintain radio silence until the task is finished. If you are discovered, I will deny any knowledge of your existence. And as a fugitive Roslin clone, I will be obligated to hunt you down. I have no intention of getting caught. Having a colonial cruiser this close to your home base may cause irritation for your companions. You're right. I better check on them. Oh. Do what I say or die. And succeed or die. <laughs> what is this? I feel like I just hopped into a mission possible maybe. is going on why is there a great big colonial cruiser at our door they were my ride home i realize this looks bad but maybe we can play things to our advantage first things first has maddox shown up you were expecting hey, more company up. i was hoping but maybe it was too much to expect a mercenary like maddox to follow through circumstances have changed i'm in a real bind now i need to do a top secret job for the fleet if I pull this off, we'll be given some kind of reprieve from the colonial authorities. But uh, I don't know to what extent that means, or if I can trust this commissioner. God damn it, Adam. What have you gotten us into? Hey, Alec. Back when I was delivering the Red Plasma Gin, you mentioned that there was a smuggler's route open to Zarkov? Where's it located? No idea, but I'm sure Tarjak, that Okar bootlegger, would know if anyone did. Okay, I'm heading to Cartwright's Wake to catch up with him. You might not hear from me for a while. If Maddox shows up, tell him to sit tight. We'll hold the fort. Let us know when you need bailing out. I forgot. Ben, even though he's like his best friend, does not know that we are a clone. He's not told that information. Not yet, anyway. Sure, we will eventually. But that is about 30 minutes. So I'm going to call the video here. I'm going to keep on around 30 minutes as best as possible while maintaining the story and whatnot but if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe to the channel there's a lot more ever space to come and a lot ever space on the channel already check all that out and i will catch you guys later hope you're having a good one and i will see you in the next video